Olasukbo Ajani, the Assistant Inspector General of Police AIG in charge of Zone 11, has appealed to Nigerians to stop attacking the personnel of the force and see them as brothers and sisters. Ajani made the appeal on Tuesday during a stakeholders meeting and his familiarization visit to the police command in Oyo State at the command headquarters in Eleyeli, Ibadan. According to the AIG, Nigerians do not respect the police as they used to before the NSAS protest, adding that the police and the citizens have been working together. Mm. Wow, police is your friend. That is what they always talk about, that they are called, they are there was this cordial relationship according to this AIG that the cordial there was cordial relationship between the masses and the police. Then the question is that why is there no coordination or the, that cordial relationship? You need to ask yourself. You need to ask yourself the 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 real truth. The people who are who fought for you, who were trying to like okay, neglect even what they were even passing through as the masses and said, okay. Uh, we have seen all of the things that you've been talking about. That is how you guys, you, you know, sorry to say, majority of the policemen are trickish. Majority of them are trickish. They will tell you, oh, bail is free. They will tell you police is your friend. It's a lie. It's a lie. There's a limit as to which you can deceive somebody. People have watched you guys over the time. They have watched you. They have seen everything. And at the end of the day, they began to see that these guys are not really truthful to us. They are lying to us. They are not our friends. They can never be our friends. A situation whereby they would say, oh, security is the business of everybody. In, so because a police is not spirit, they cannot be everywhere. At the same time, if you see anything that is going on in your area or you see any funny things around you, inform the police. Over the time, this is not a matter of a, okay, yes, a, a, maybe some people are insinuating. A lot of people have had an experience in one way or the other. You go and give police that information before you know it. You that you have gone to report, they will come after you. Uh -huh. Now your mouth shall pass. Now you shall be, now you be police, this and this and that. They are still going to be the traitors. And not, not to talk of every day thing that we see on the road. We see on the road. What are you talking about? When the answers came and the answers protest came and people started saying, no, these are grievances towards you. This and this and this and that. What did you do? Up to now. Whether that is what you have signed for, like they always say, obey the before uh, complain. You are must obey the last command. So whether the the command or the order you have been given is right or not, to the detriment of the people you are supposed to protect, is none of your business. You just have to carry out the real thing. We saw we saw many things. Now. Even Mr. Macaroni recently, a lot, you know, our uncountable. Now you are coming out to tell us that uh, the police uh, and the masses, their brothers and sisters, like seriously, you guys have to rethink. You know, we have been talking about uh, the politicians that we don't even know what we even change the politicians to have a, a change of heart from being wicked to be good. And yet they are the ones spending the words and the sweat of the masses. Yes, they are not nice. I don't know why you will be leading people and you expect them and you want them to continue to live in poverty and suffering and living in pain. So maybe this will even teach you guys lessons, which is not really too good because you push people to the wall. Ah, before now, they used to say, oh, Nigerians are too docile. Nigerians call, just talk, 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 no action. Talk, 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 no action. And you thought that uh, that is going to be like that forever. There is no way. It is natural when you push somebody or force somebody to the to the dead end. Definitely the person will reverse back. That is what you are seeing. So if everything wants to be fine, it is not in your hand to be able to address the issue. And again, how can you be working in that kind of a, a condition? The government has put you. The same politicians Nigerians are complaining about. They are the same people that have put you guys in this mess. Why? Why is it that you guys cannot even... I don't know whether you have told them. Of course, these politicians have something else again. Because they have put you in this uh, mess. At the end of the day, you still want to bring that pain and suffering. Or that uh, whatever. To arm the people. In the sense that you know, we want to revenge on the people. Which is not supposed to be. Not at all. So, you guys have to amend your ways. Nigerians have, have taken enough. Nigerians have taken enough. Especially those politicians, eh? <clears throat> Let them continue. Let them continue and begin to play to the gallery. You can imagine putting in Booth's wife. Telling uh, uh, a colleague to stop lamenting. 
that is a you see a pdp person that will be complaining so it's only pdp so when you guys are seeing things wrong in your party in the country respect of everything you just you have to keep quiet that the man is a is a is a wolf in sheep clothing a traitor you see the wickedness of people a woman that's supposed to know what people are going through even if men do not even understand but unfortunately unfortunately it is even man that has that pain of what is happening in the country who if somebody that calls herself a woman telling the man to stop it is woman that used to have a sympathy in everything so it is they, they give this guy woman this tinubu wife they give her a, a, a president hey. and they want to be they want she want maybe people are saying she wants to be she wants to be the first lady well police are enemies of innocent people police are friend friends to full any people can you tell me why police and army attacking those people that are protecting their family from Fulani and police don't want to kill Fulani but are killing people that fighting for fighting Fulani that means you allow Fulani to kill innocent people and you police have been killing innocent people here in Nigeria this is time to kill oh ah, this was it they will not go all those you're talking it's not gonna happen no. me my okay escape are you still hiding? Why? SKP, are you still hiding? Why? Why are you still hiding? They are telling the policeman, why is still hiding? Men on uniform were the cause of the attacks nowadays. Mr. EIG, just go ahead and train your men to do their work with justice, fairness, and fear of God. Bros, me no, uh, me nobody will attack me again, and we see them as our friends. Police is your, it's now only for full name. Colluding with them perpetrating criminal activities against others, extorting money from people and treating, uh, threatening people and even killing them. Policemen and officers cause the problem they are facing. Things are not changing until they change from their evil ways. Example, travel from Lagos to Asaba in Delta State. You will miss over 250 police roadblocks. Yet, armed robbers use their roadblocks to rob innocent nigerians they cause avoidable accidents and unnecessary hold up that makes a journey of five five hours to last for a whole day they are devils before nigerians all the innocent people police and women killed their blood is fighting police and army and all the forces in nigeria until police officers change from that demon in them the same we Nigerians are passing through hell from them. So shall it be with Nigeria police and the force in them. So guys, let's say your opinion and let's know your thoughts on this. Thank you.